Hey guys, and lady guys, my name is Otkin and welcome to new video, thank you all for 5000 subs, if you are new here make sure to subscribe to you don't miss new videos, and of course leave a like and comment for algorithm, thanks, now enjoy. My discord community spun a wheel, to be featured on r slash roast, and I won. I don't know what my favorite color is, and I'm 5 feet tall. Sometimes blonde hair works on Asian boys, not this time. It works on gremlins though. Showing more root than a mangrove. Your vibe screams tootie from the fairly odd parents. Is she surprised, or trying to save money, by doing her own eyebrows? Come on, you're the only one in your discord community. Why do you look surprised? You look like a My Little Pony character in human form. Welcome to Reddit, Turd Blossom. Good thing your glasses are so big, so your cheeks can see too. I didn't know whether to roast you, or give you a carrot. 20. Let's see what you've got. I never wondered what Liv Tyler would look like, if Jay Leno was her dad, but I guess now I know anyway. You look like someone spontaneously painted a Mona Lisa at her NJ turnpike rest stop. With a lopsided face like that, now nah, this is a Picasso. Second breakfast at Tiffany's. You've got the jawline of a proboxer. The crimson chin has entered the chat. I'm sure you'll take this roast on the chin. You look like the strong type of woman who doesn't need a boyfriend to be happy, especially with fingers that size. She saves a fortune by doing her own pap smears with her finger nail. You are like, Wyoming hot. Bruh, I grew in Wyoming. we used to say you don't lose your girlfriend, you just lose your turn. Winters we're hard, man. Real hard. I'd rate you as a one half bottle of Jack and a six pack of PBR. That's what it would take. Respectable. Nearly blind. Just finished my first braille sheet. Make my eyes cry at least. A blind man walks into our slash roast, and a wall, and a shelf, and a bookcase. I'd make more jokes, but I don't think Op will see the point. Good news is you won't see your hairline recede anymore. If you feel your face then at least you have learnt in braille what virgin is. Well I guess he did not see that coming. I just translated the first few lines hello, I'm required by state law. To inform you I have been placed on the offender's register, and have moved into the area. The next line I presume, is the address as I can't make sense of it. The camera's down here buddy. Nothing to see here. I had a vision for your future, and pictured you with a beautiful blonde on your arm. I realize now it was a Labrador. We can say just about anything, and he won't be able to read it anyways. If you're blind. Then where's your cane? I heard that, if you lose your eyesight your other senses improve. It doesn't look like that included your fashion sense. 22. F just a flat chested league player looking for a roast. Trying to keep a creepy teenager aesthetic will not deter from the fact that you peaked some time ago. Your nickname is Bad Pirate, because the chest is empty. What's up with all the dudes posting with wigs today? They're minerals merry. Uncanny. Everyone seems to be focused on your tatars and frankly I can't figure out how they managed it. It's like one of those I spy books. You just keep looking until you can find the damn things. You can't get lower than fishing for compliments and roast. Hmm? Buying your shirts at Baby Gap won't make them bigger. Don't think that, just because you're out of focus doesn't mean we can't tell you have enough acne to be the before photo for a Neutrogenia commercial. Sorry to break it to you, but the guys in the white vans won't be offering you any candy so stop dressing like a tweener. I can see your Adam's apple. Stage 3 cancer can't even break my spirit. Do your worst. If none of your boyfriends would stick around, I don't think cancer will either. Finally, the drapes match the carpet. Maybe stage 4 will do the trick. Well, I did ask for this. Hey no we roasting you, but hope you get better. At least you have a good sense of tumor. Look at the bright side you've never been as high as a 3 in your life. 
there are worse weight loss techniques. Seriously, from one cancer survivor to another. Focus on clean, negative test results and thoughts of you looking back on this experience as a distant memory. Best of luck to you. Making it hard to root against cancer. We'll talk here, I'm not sure, if you are just down, and throwing more on top, to bury the real emotions a bit more, or if you indeed don't take yourself that seriously, and are in it for a good laugh. But cancer is a bitch and you look, like you're pretty affected by it given your post history. Especially during this time, try to surround yourself with those you love, leave the subreddits full of negativity, and seek out the little things, that make you happier. That type of energy will do more for your mental health in the long run, and has been shown to lead to more positive cancer outcomes. Subreddits like this one will be here when you come back. Let's dump on you then when you're happy, healthy, smiling, and have kicked cancer's ass. I'm addicted to Pokemon, I'm a stepdad to a baracial baby boy, and I'm in love with my elementary school sweetheart. You have to wait for your elementary school sweetheart to turn 18. I bet you found out you were the stepdad when the baby was born. I'm guessing you can't come within 500 feet of your sweetheart's school, huh? You got friend zoned so damn hard, you're taking care of another man's kid, and you still haven't gotten laid. I see your wife's boyfriend is letting you stay up past your bedtime. My guess is you will be the stepdad to many more biracial children. The sweetheart who got kid from other guy, and has no other option than you, yeah quite a love love story. Post Malone but from an alternate timeline, where he has no job, and just stays at home with his parents. I feel like I can smell this picture. Please humorously mock, or humiliate us with well-timed jokes. Eskimo kiss is only in this relationship. Well they are siblings, mom is watching. Mom is watching from the closet with a magic wand on maximum vibration. Couldn't afford the hour, but at least you got this picture. Okay, but only if you promise to stop staring at me like you desperately need a third. Ten pounds says he's wearing a chastity cage. Who knows what to say. From the bags under your eyes, it looks like you're both tired of each other. Now there's a couple of dead-eyed creepo psychopaths you pray don't end up moving next to you. The space between her eyes is very disrespectful. You look like you have to order for him at restaurants, because you're a bee, and he has anxiety. Thanks for watching you grass eating animals.